Hello and welcome to Europa Universalis for the new Cahokia. Um, the, what you previously saw of this was actually a pilot. Um, we did a few of those, and we might release the other ones at some point, but you guys seem to be enjoying this enough that um, I think we're just going to make this our, our regular series for the time being. Again, doesn't mean we're not ever going to go back to the, um, to the Russia game. Um, but this, I think, is going to be our weekly series for the time being, uh, since everyone seemed to be enjoying it quite a bit. So, we are in a war with uh, the Creek, the Pawnee, the Sioux, and the... I believe that's pronounced Cinnabonny, but I could be wrong. Um, if anybody happens to know, I would be, be happy to be corrected. And our allies just lost a big battle against this stack down here, um, which is super bummer. Um, improve relations with the font. Why are you giving us this mission? That's that's a useless mission. So we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and try to finish the siege. Might go down to speed three just because I wanna I wanna kind of keep an eye on what's going on here a little better. We don't want to lose the Wichita. Um, we don't, we don't, we can't really afford to lose any of our allies at this point. Actually, I'm thinking going after the Sioux first might have been smarter. Um, just by the simple fact that, uh, it could have taken somebody out of the war faster. Um, but we can, we can afford to lose some of these provinces down here. So... I think that our goal is going to be, we'll finish the Siege of Pawnee, and then we'll, uh... Siege of Pawnee makes me think of Parks and Rec, which is pretty funny. Oh, no! <sighs> We're not going to be able to get there in time, are we? Keep your fucking stacks together! I don't understand why the AI has such a hard time understanding that the way you win in EU4 is keeping your stacks together until there are no stacks large enough to challenge you for dominance. Um... They, they seem to have a really tough time with that, and I don't know why. I think the Cherokee actually just got stack wiped because they were not being smart. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna try to use this stack to do some some counter attacking here. Oh shoot. All right, we got we got to do this first. Um, okay, wait, 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 wait. I think I think I got this. I think I got this. We can consolidate everybody down here. Yeah, we want to force a fight, but we want to force a fight on our terms. So let's see if we can catch up to these guys. Okay, there's going to be a battle here, and we're going to join it. And I accidentally retreated from the battle. Oh, fuck. Okay, I just did the exact same thing again. Uh, we'll roll with it. Okay, so I want all of my allies to follow me. Yeah, we'll lose ten ducats. I don't care. All right, are you attached? Stay here. Don't go anywhere. Please. Okay, here we go. We're gonna win one, we're gonna lose one, I think. Hopefully I can just retreat from this immediately. Because I don't think we're gonna get our... Our guys, they're fast enough. Alright, how when can we retreat? We can retreat on the 13th of September, yeah, we're gonna be dead before then. Alright, um... Do we have the manpower? Yes. We don't have the money. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go deep into debt to try to see if we can salvage this war. Also, did we raise war taxes? We should definitely be raising war taxes.
Where are their marauding stacks? I want to keep a fairly tight distribution here, if possible. All right. That's as much as we can build for now. Suppose I could hire mercenaries. Oh, no, wait. Natives can't hire mercenaries. Never mind. All right. I want to piece out as many of the belligerents as we can here. Are we taking stupid attrition? Yes, we are. Um, so let's detach a siege. Let's do this. Okay, let's detach another siege. Okay. We good? We good? You guys got this? Don't care about the fox. We're actually making money, which is funny. We might actually be able to pay back one of the loans that we took soon. All right, where is the main enemy stack? Down there? All right. I think we can, I think we can do this. It's going to be tough, but I think we can do it. Preak of Occupied Tennessee. We're going to go deal with that. So help me, allies. If you don't follow me into battle, we're going to have a big, big problem. And we renewed a bank loan. That's all right. Okay. So if they're going after the Cherokee... Okay, the Cherokee are following us. That's good. Send these guys down here. Okay, so they, it looks like they actually are going to catch the Cherokee. So let's see if we can save them. Terrain bonuses. Come on. Get there. Help is on the way. Yes! Okay, that is the sound of someone who was very stressed out becoming somewhat less stressed out. <laughs> Let's stack wipe these fools. Let's stack wipe these fools. Come on. Come on, get there. Where the hell are they retreating to? Apparently a zillion miles away. Okay, I think I think we have kind of successfully turned the war around. <laughs> or we're in the process of turning it around. And I think we can even, we can get a native idea, construction costs, sure. Our tradition of relocating villages when soils grow poor has led us to improve our construction methods. By harnessing those new methods and spreading them, we can greatly benefit. And we might, yeah, even be able to repay a loan here. There we go. We can even reduce inflation. How about that? Where are they retreating to? Are they retreating to Winnebago? Oh, they're retreating all the fucking way over there. I see. Okay. All right. Um, well, let's, uh, let's go relieve the Wichita. It looks like our allies have this handled. What's the freaking supply limit here? Yeah, we should be fine. I don't know what you guys are tripping about with all this, like, oh, we've got attrition, oh no. Okay, I was, I was, uh, I was seriously prepared to just lose that war, but I think we've managed to turn it around. I'm feeling good. Um, so this is the Sioux. We're gonna sue the Sioux for peace. Not sorry at all about that pun. Um, and we want you to annul your treaty. Yeah, send us war reparations. The Pawnee are going to be annexed, I believe. Are they the war goal? 
Yeah, so annul your treaty with the, Cinnab the Cinnabon Empire. And we will... Gotcha! Awesome. Pay back as many loans as we can. Still got 13 loans, that's okay. And then get back to our territory. Okay. Well, they threw a really cracking good counterpunch. Um, but I do not think it was enough. Uh, I just don't want the Wichita to peace out of the war and, and leave, leave us with a bunch of... There are much fewer troops. That's why I'm, I'm putting a, some focus up here. All right. Or would it make more sense to take the Cinnabon out of the war first? What's our next smallest loan? Oh, okay, cool. We could pay off some more loans. See, we're making money. We're making money from the process of warfare, which is what we want to be doing. They've split up their army, which is not smart. And yeah, we'll just we'll start sieging down some creek stuff. Keep an eye on the situation down here in case they decide to attack our allies. We will jump in and help them. And it looks like they are, so we'll wait for them to lock in. They're locked in. We'll finish this siege. I think we have time. All right. And here we come to the rescue. They should be taking terrain penalty here. All right. We got this. We got this. Come on. Awesome. And where are they fleeing to? They are fleeing to... Kusa? Alright, so they're probably gonna go here and we'll try to stack wipe them on the way. They abandoned the Siege of Pawnee. Taking a lot more casualties than I'd like to. Oh, because we don't have a general on this stack, that's why. Actually, just stay here and siege it. I'm not worried. All right. Looking good. I <laughs> don't know who that is, but they're getting their butts kicked. Chiraw is coming to the. Uh, let's see. We'll transfer that to Cherokee. We don't. We don't need that province. And then we'll just come hang out down here by our allies, so we can reinforce them if needed. Did we not peace out the Sioux? Oh, they're occupied by the Fox now. I was like, what the fuck? All right, the creek should be done for. So we're going to take some of their land. Um, yeah, you know what? We'll give we'll give some more to the Cherokee. We'll, we'll leave them with one province. How about that? That way they can pay us war reparations. And we want them to give us all their money. I guess they won't be paying us war reparations. That's all right. Awesome. Okay. So, we need to core that land. Awesome. Make sure the recording's still going. Good. I have this, like, OCD thing where I panic that the recording has stopped, and I always have to check on it. Pay off some more loans. Down to ten loans. And who's still in this war? It's the Pawnee and the Cinnabon Empire. So let's uh, say friendlies can attach to this. Let's hire another general if we can. Because why not? Oh, we're at too many military leaders. Well, 
We're going to hang out in Tennessee and hopefully our friends will follow us. Siege of Mandan is over. So we're going to go siege these guys. See if we can get them to pay us for the privilege of being kicked in the teeth. Creek is no longer a valid rival, so we're going to have to pick a new one. Uh, we have... Oh, we can't add rivals at war. Pawnee wants peace offer. Of course they do. <laughs> Not yet. Okay, so they're, they're leaving. They're going to go try to defend their territory, which means we can just hang out here probably. Actually, I don't know where they're going at this point. We're going to bump it up to speed 4, because I'm not really worried about losing the war anymore. Oh, they're going to go try to... Let's see. Yeah, we'll take the ducats. Pay off a loan. So what is our military power gain at? 5? We can live with that for now. Playing a war chief. Um, let's see, we're at war and, well, so-so has ruled our people wisely in peacetime. We need a respected warrior. Zero one five, where we gain Diplo power. I'm not gonna take a zero one five, that's, that's crappy. All right, we're keeping an eye on them. We're hoping that we finish our siege before they finish theirs. Yeah, we'll renew the war taxes. We need money more than we need mill power right now. Okay, they're they're leaving. It's kind of what I figured. So yeah, this should end uh, this should end fairly favorably for us actually. Of course, you want a peace offer. Now we got to peace out your friends first, dude. They're now hanging out in Fox, so we're gonna back off one province. Chickasaw Moon. The garden is bathed in the cool light of a full moon. Turning a corner to come across the site was not what you expected, but here it is. Before you stands a monument to Chickasaw's subjugation of Illinowek. The beauty lies not in the exquisite marble, which we wouldn't have access to, or even in the craftsmanship of the thing, but in the fact that even now, many years later, the monument is still strewn with thousands and thousands of fresh flowers. Here, if nowhere else, the memory of the Chickasaw subjugation of Illinowek and the memories of the fall still lives. So our people have uh, have created a floral um, monument to that time that we kicked the Illinowek's ass. Sorrow proves justness of our cause. May the memory live on. We'll take the mill power. We've been spending some mill power to hire generals and keep our war taxes up. Oh, hey, we've got a good general here in our, our allies. That's a quality general. We're not that far in manpower dead either. We can get that back going fairly easily, I think. Looks like it's time to pay off another loan. Down to eight loans. Okay, cool. So let's peace out the Cinnabons. Um, we need them to war operations I don't think we really want them as a vassal at this point 17% 16% oh maybe we can afford to have one more vassal how much would that cost 19% war score not that much actually um, we want you to annul some treaties. Oh, I'm negotiating with the Pawnee here. Okay, the Cinnabons. There we go. Uh, vassal, and then as much money as you'll give us. There we go. Um... Sure. Yeah, I think we can afford to... Oh, what? Wait, we're over our Diplo relations limit. So we shouldn't do that, actually. That's actually not something we want to do. 
Pawnee is going to be annexed. We don't need them to annul that treaty. Fine. And then we're going to reduce inflation. We're going to pay off a lot of loans. War economy, my friends. That is how it works. Let's bring these guys back to the capital. And then we are going to wait for our diplomat to come home, and we're going to uh, end the war here. Okay. That's the correct one, right? Okay. We want to take your only province. We want to take all your money, and that's all. That's all we ask. Excellent. Excellent. 